Patients also ask me quite often, uh, what type of exercises can I do after surgery? What can I do to speed recovery or make things easier after surgery? And the answer is actually better before surgery. So for example, weight training, uh, a little bit of aerobic exercise, just to keep yourself toned, you are gonna be non-weight bearing for a week to three weeks because uh, we're dealing with something called torque. Your body weight on a small lever arm pushing off is an amazing amount of force. Even Leonardo da Vinci writes about how complicated the foot is. So yes, this is a little bit more important beforehand because you won't lose as much muscle tone. Now, while you're in recovery early on, you can wiggle your toes a little bit, move your ankle around a wee bit, but until you're actually placing your foot on the ground and doing a few other things, you really don't want to do a lot. Now, for bone osteotomies or fractures and things of that nature, it'll be closer to the four to six week area. And then we'll start to do things with physical therapy, or you can buy the elastic bands to start to move the foot back and forth, up and down, just to get a little bit of strength, stretching with a towel with your calf, getting some more stretching and range of motion. Even putting your hands behind your neck and doing a full squat in your bathroom, kind of a deep knee bend, doing a set of 10, a set of 30, that gets the range of motion going, doesn't stress out the surgery too much, that helps out a lot too. And then usually at the second or third month, you can get completely back to the gym and do whatever you're doing before.